Okay, so this video here is going to show you how to access Teams and how to navigate it. It's going to be a very quick tour of the Teams software. So from our Glow Launchpad, we're in the Meldrum Academy Launchpad, which is the little house, you click Microsoft Teams and that automatically logs you into your Teams grid, your Teams Launchpad, where you see all the different teams that you are a member of. Okay, now down the side here, we've got different buttons. If you click Activity, it shows you a feed of all the different things that you've been tagged in. Okay, it shows you the, the assignments that you've been tagged in as well, and it shows you their due date. Okay, so anything at all that you've been tagged in, you will be alerted through the activity. The Teams button takes you into specific teams. Okay, or if we go back to our home page, you can see the whole thing. Okay, so the Teams button is to navigate through your different teams. While we're here, the Settings button, if you switch view, it might be worthwhile having your teams in a list down the side so that you can see them all, all of the time. Okay, I find this quite useful, but if you prefer the grid, you can so switch it back very easily. Okay. Underneath teams, we've got assignments. Now this little red dot means that I have got an assignment that I haven't opened yet. So that's quite useful to keep your eye on that little bit there so that you can click onto your assignments. Your assignments are sorted by class and we'll find out how to access these in another video. <clears throat> The calendar is also very useful. As you can see here, I've added in that I've got homework due for maths tomorrow at 10, 11 o'clock and tomorrow at 2 o'clock. Okay, so to add in your homework, if you want to go to next week, let's say I've got maths homework due at 12 o'clock on Tuesday, I just highlight the box and then say homework due for maths. That's really useful for keeping your assignments organised and it gives you little reminders by looking at the calendar. The files tab also shows you all the different files that you've viewed recently, different files within different teams that you're a member of, and it also gives you a direct link to your OneDrive. Now, if you see something went wrong, you just click a couple of times, if voila, it works like that. Okay. Within each team, we then have different tabs across the top. So if I go into my French team, we've got posts. Okay, so this is like a wall for different messages. You've got your files tab for specific files that the teacher has put into that team and pupils can also put files in as well. We've got the class notebook, which will be explained in a different video. We've got assignments. Again, I'll go into more detail about how to use the assignments tabs in a, in a video later on. And we've got grades. Now the grades tab shows you exactly what assignments you've got due, the assignment name, the status so whether you've handed it in or not and how many points your teacher has given you for it. Teachers can also add specific tabs to websites at the top. Okay so if I click this one all I need to do to go to that website is click go to the site and it opens straight away for me. Okay so that's really handy as well. So that's a quick tour of Teams for you. Hopefully that was useful.